of this function 1987 batch graduates who pass the Commerce Institute, the Faculty of Institute, the present students, the employees, ladies and gentlemen. At the outset, I would like to rather thank the director of the institute to give me the opportunity to revisit the institute and share my sentiments with you on this occasion. It's a, it's a great thing that has been started. Both of the institutions are holding such functions where they are just honoring their pass -outs. And I think DCPI was started it. They must take it up. It is something which empowers the students who are at present studying here. They do look into their future and accordingly they, they proceed ahead. As an inspiration, those of you who have come here, the 87 dash students who are quite proud of now, who are receiving to see uh, such accolades from people all around, the applause from people all around, that they can always tell their juniors the gap, whatever is there, by their coming to the institution, was a year, is filled very nicely. I, I was fortunate enough to have a small estate to get attached to this institution as a, as a director for maybe about six months or so. I am closely interacted with the faculty and the students and I really saw potential in people here. Given the right opportunity, they can do wonders. That kind of opportunity is here. It's only because of the fact that I do felt proud because the institution besides geography had a history also. I was director of SPDI. SPDI was, say, it came up in 1921 and your institution, TCDI, came in 1914. Still, it's a matter of pride for the institution which has been completed in 100 years, maybe two years hence. That's something for which I exhort you people, the 87 batch, or maybe the other students who you know, to come forward and celebrate the centenary of the institution in a very big way. Rather, I would I would that let the launching of the centenary celebrations be done right today. Why cannot we hold it for two years completely? See, there are so many activities with which you can continue holding. You can you can keep on reminding the world that GCTI is completing hundred years. It's basically on different towns. You can organize different things for industry people, for, for workers there, for staff there, but whatever kind of people they are there, you can attract the attention of the world and you can tell that still you are a force to record it. I mean, that kind of thing should be there because textile sector is one sector which has always found priority and will continue finding it. The vision of people, the requirement of people, their, their taste. But I mean, there are so many factors behind it, which keep or keeps you know, people on their toes because the search for the excellence is always on. Now maybe wherever the clothing is required in very, very tough conditions, it may be armed forces, it may be industrial workers, it may be anywhere where people are working. Given the different conditions, these clothings they have to be with different properties basically. So I mean, there is not any point where you can say that the development stops here. The, the perennial development of textiles is happening there in the past also is going on and it will continue to grow further. So I would just I would say it in a way that the, the, the batches who are here and mostly specifically in the seven batch students, they must go out, they must hold interactive sessions and they must tell them as to what industry want. Even they could help just have a nice day and go to the institution. Thank you all.
में उपस्थित हैं हमें उनकी भी सुविधाओं का पूरा ख्याल रखना है और भी जो मीडिया में थे जो हमारे मित्र बाहर खड़े हैं आप उनको प्लीज कॉल कर लीजिए क्योंकि अब ये वो समय है आपको सत्यपाल भाई साहब का और राज्यपाल सर का भाई साहब ने बहुत फलीभूत होते हुए नजर आ रहे हैं उन्होंने डेल आई डी टू थाउजेंड टेन में क्रिएट की और उस डेल आई डी को जो रेस्पॉन्स मिला Thank you. 